Hey, what is going on guys? So you are using the video editor Filmora 9 and you want to know how to record your screen and use the, um, the webcam at the same time. It's very, very simple. So what I want you to do is go up here where it says record, tap on record, and then we have three things down here, okay? The first one says record from webcam. So if I tap on that, and I have a built-in webcam right here, okay? The th thing is, if you want to record uh, from some kind of webcam and you don't have like a built-in webcam or you want something better, you can just buy a webcam and, you know, get the ones that plug into your USB port, plug it in, and it, and it should find it right away. Anyways, let me go ahead and take this off because this video is not about just the webcam itself. But we have another one here. It says uh, record PC screen, which we can record the PC screen, but we can also record from the uh, webcam at the same time as well, which we're going to use. And just FYI, the bottom down here is just to record a voiceover, okay? Anyways, we're going to go with the middle one here, and it says record PC screen. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on that. Now, this pops up here, okay? And now, we can go ahead and tap on the um, tap on the settings down here, that little down arrow. Tap on that, and then this window here pops up. And I already have my uh, my camera enabled. If I uncheck that, it'll be like that. If you want to use your um, your webcam or whatnot, you have to click this down here where it says record uh, camera stream. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that right there. So so from up here, we can do like a full screen if you want to show the entire screen of your computer. And if I select down, we can go to custom or target window. I'm just going to go ahead and leave this one on full screen. That's the one I use most of the time. And if we look over here, you can see the uh, mic right here. It's using my built-in mic that's in my Dell computer now. However, when I typically do voiceovers or record my screen with Femora, I usually use uh, another headset. It just sounds a little bit better. It doesn't sound so e echoey. And this one here just plugs in by USB port. And it's all plug and play. Same thing if you have like a webcam. Anyways, let me just plug this into the uh, USB port and I'll show you how it finds it, okay? So let me go ahead and pop this in here. And as soon as I popped it in here, let's give it a second to find it here. Okay, so now this popped up here, the microphone G90, which is this headphone here, which is the mic here that I use. And down here it says save to. Once we're done recording the uh, screen recording, it's going to save it to this default location, which is basically in my documents, then in the Wondershare Filmora 9 folder, and then it's under... I think screen record, but we'll go back into that later. But you can also change the actual uh, save to. You can save it to your desktop or whatnot. Down here, we have the uh, frames per second. The max is 30 FPS frames per second. So just leave it at 30 FPS. And the quality here, you can do a good, better, or best. I just leave it at better. And down here, you probably want this check too. Basically, if you have this check down here, it says show mouse clicks in a recording. So every time you basically like click, it's going to give that little round thing, okay, every time you click on the mouse. And this down here, play mouse click sound, which you probably don't want. So every time you do that, it's going to record that sound, which gets annoying. So I'm going to go ahead and leave that one unchecked. And to pause or uh, resume, the default is space. That's fine. Now, and down here to start and stop, the default is F9, but I'm on a Windows 10 computer, and I couldn't leave it at F9 because every time I press on F9 to stop, stop the video, like, for example, I'll press on F9, then this will pop up. It won't actually stop the video. So I had to change it to uh, end here. So you can go ahead and change it to whatever you want. Like, if I press page up on my keyboard, it'll show that page down. I can press on home, but I'll just go ahead and press end on my keyboard just like that. And then down here is the uh, integrated webcam, which is my built-in webcam that I have on my uh, laptop here. But like I said, if you have a external or another webcam that you plug into a USB port, it should be plug and play, and it'll find it. It'll give you another option down here as well. Now, before I go ahead and press and record, you know, the, the window here is, is here as well. And, you know, you can actually resize this window as well. If you put it to the side right there, you can go ahead and resize this to any size uh, that you want and then you can go ahead and move it around so let me go ahead and press on start and once you put on click it on start it's going to give you a countdown okay three two one and of course you can be anywhere on your screen you know you can go ahead and uh, bring up like a browser you can even actually be on the uh, Filmora uh, video editor here if you want to give like tutorials like I do and stuff like that and still even though it's recording uh, from the webcam I can move this 
image around and as I'm moving it around it's going to record the same thing too same thing you can go ahead and you can like resize it again from here and you can keep moving around as you're actually recording the video as well okay so we're still like recording here and now if I wanted to go ahead and stop remember that I pre-program mine for the uh, end key so if I press the end key it's going to turn off Another way to turn it off as well is you can go ahead and press on record up here and then go down to record PC screen. And then once I tap on that bottom right hand corner, that's going to show up here. Okay, so once I end it, the uh, video recording that I just did, it's automatically going to show up like in this window here. But also remember where the video file is actually saved. Let me just uh, right click on this video and let me find the target here. I'll go to uh, reveal in Explorer. I'll tap on that and I'll show you exactly where it is. Okay, so it's under Documents, Wondershare Filmora 9 folder, and then it's under Recorded, okay? So the last folder would be under Recorded. And then pretty much here is the, um, the video file that we just saved. I'll bring it on the timeline here. I'll match it to media and I'll go ahead and play it just to give you like an example here. Sorry about that, I just unplugged my headphones so you can actually hear the audio come out directly from my computer. So let me press on play, and this is pretty much what we just recorded. Stuff like that. You can and see, still, even though it's recording, uh, from the webcam, you, can, can you can see the window is still moving as well. As well. And then anything that's on your screen, okay? Now, on even when I here, brought up the to browser to over here. That, right so, show up here. There you guys go. It's pretty simple. If you guys have any questions, uh, anything regarding Femora 9, just comment and I'll help you guys out. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.